So we were just talking about Walmart's recent acquisition. And again, we dropped that link in the chat there. Y'all can check that out and let us know what, uh, what your take is on that story. Let's move over to talk manufacturing, Kevin. One of my favorite right. things to talk about. I love the manufacturing industry. Um, a lot so, of change but, there. A lot of change. Uh, you're absolutely right. Uh, and in fact, this is going to be kind of a tale of two cities here in this report from the Wall Street Journal where they say the current environment is getting more challenging for many manufacturers here in the States. So the Institute of Supply Management, ISM, they put out um, a monthly report that really measures a variety of things, but especially focuses on manufacturing activity and whether it's uh, expanding or contracting. Well, the September numbers came out last week, and it's still the manufacturing industry here in the States is still growing and expanding, but at a uh, smaller or at a um, – slower pace than it has been. So there's a few factors at play. And we'll hit a couple here. Interest rates, mm -hmm. of course, have jumped up, yeah. which will decrease demand in the housing markets. And that's going to push a lot of new factory orders down, right? The housing industry drives a lot of manufacturing activity. And the export market is looking uh, less than rosy given the strong U.S. dollar, which might sound seem kind of counterintuitive, but the strong U.S. dollar and overseas economic challenges. So that's um, not helping our orders. But on the flip side, the mighty automotive sector, which is paramount yeah. to manufacturing activity, demand has been strong because folks can't get their hands on new cars. The used car market has really blown up in the last couple of years, right? So, Kevin, your thoughts here about some of this manufacturing news? Well, you know, uh, one of the biggest transitions, and we talked about this be before on the buzz, is transition from fossil fuels to electric vehicles. So will um, all these cars that are waiting for parts, um, will they now not be able to be sold? Because like states like California are now mandating the transition to electric uh, vehicles. 